Welcome back for another edition of Cosmic Crucible. Today I am 18.9 million TCP, pushing that 19 million mark. My opponent is Stefo. And Stefo is uh, 23.2 million TCP today. I'm uh I'm at plat plat two currently, working my way to plat three, but I probably won't do it this week, maybe next week, hopefully. We'll see. Um so my previous opponent, uh Skippy McWonderby. I just want to go over their attacks real fast. Uh they took uh gamma into Darkhold. Got the job done pretty easily. Uh, they didn't took uh, Masters of Evil with um, Kestrel into Young Avengers. Smashed it. That turn bonus is ridiculously good. What was the turn bonus on the last one? Oh, the turn bonus was terrible on that one, though. All right, for stage three here, they took Weapon X into my uh, Infinity Watch and got the job done with a zero turn bonus. That's That's horrid. <laughs> and then uh they took a uh, ux into ux which i've been seeing a lot of here recently i'm, I'm not even sure how to win this match personally I, I imagine it just takes controlling the rogue and the gambit somehow but <clears throat> uh interesting interesting result there uh then they tried to take their infinity watch into my weaver team and got their stuff handed to them then they went in there with uh, Death Seed and got it handed to them even harder. And then they went in there the last time with a uh, New Warriors comp and did not win whatsoever. So uh, because they couldn't clear this room, I I, uh, I ended up winning the match. And then uh, they ended up using their massive Dark Hold into my Wakanda and way, way overpowered it. <clears throat> Anyway, that's, uh, that was his attack, and I ended up winning the match against him. So today I have uh, this fight, another big old rebirth team. That's what I'm going to be throwing my uh, rebirth counter at. And then uh, this is the stuff here. So we'll start here today. Pretty standard uh, battle nowadays. So. Not worried about this one at all. All right, so uh, I'm going to stay on top of Black Panther here. Nice landed the slows. I love it. Okay, I'm gonna go over here and ability block this guy. Drop some robots down. Oh, I forget that the robots do attacks. I gotta remember to uh to use that to my advantage from now on. I keep forgetting to do that, so okay, so I'm gonna Turn rewind right here. Throw up some defense downs. That helps a bunch. Get my uh, get my buffs up here. All right. So uh, I don't want BP to get a turn. So I'm, I'm gonna lay it on him. All right, so uh, this is this might this will definitely kill Black Panther, but maybe not BP one mil. All oh, the striker attack got BP one mil. Okay, that's fine. So I'm going on a special here. Uh, 
Oof. Absorbing man got nixed. Mm, that Shuri special, that's not good. That's hurting my uh hurting my efficiency bonus for sure. Oh, that shouldn't yeah, that should get rid of her, okay. And then heel kick. Alright, so the efficiency on that was not that great, but it was also a really big punch up, so got the job done. All teal war dogs. Disgusting. Disgusting amounts of uh, gear investment there. All right, so into this um, really strange looking Young Avengers team, I'm going to take uh, Death Seed. I've been trying to play around with the Death Seed uh, placement. And I think I kind of like this placement a little bit more. So I think the two most valuable characters are obviously Dark Beast and Nemesis. So I keep them on the corners. And then Magneto dies, Magneto dies, so what? And then the other two are just uh, just there doing their work. <clears throat> Might actually swap Archangel and and um, Psylocke, but I know some people they like to go for um, Psylocke first. All right, so uh, I'm gonna clump them all together right here. I don't get why sometimes the Dark Beast. Uh, does his assist and sometimes he doesn't do his assist and it on that on that opening magneto move a little bit confused by that i thought his assist chance when when uh he was on the full team of death seed was like a hundred percent like he didn't ever not assist but the last two times i've used magneto's ult though uh the the assist uh from dark beast has not procced and it's kind of weird All right, so let's keep my speed up. Be really nice if uh, Squirrel Girl would just die right here. Okay. I'm wondering when and if I'm ever going to get another turn. Ah, <laughs> oh, dang, I outright killed Kate. That was amazing. Get out of here, Echo. And like right there, Dark Beast didn't assist on Magneto's special either. Just don't get it. Sometimes he assi he like assists when he wants to. It's like, come on, Dark Beast, do what you're supposed to. Like, like you're supposed to, dang it. <laughs> Failing me, boss. Hey, you dodgy McDodgerson. Good guy. Somebody, please tap that guy. Tap him into the hole. All right. So uh, the next team here I'm going to fight is going to be this rebirth team. And uh, they're not as big as some of the rebirth teams I've faced this week. So uh, not too terribly scared. Uh, I, I do like this counter though. This counter for this counter for rebirth is just amazing. It's a shame though that uh, Nick Fury is so valuable on other teams. But uh, if if you have a free Nick Fury, 
uh, and you don't know what to do with him, uh, and you have a big old rebirth to fight, uh, this is a good place to use him. I know he works well on that walking hate counter for UX, but I never see UX on defense anymore. It seems like everybody's been pulling <laughs> unlimited X-Men off of defense, and uh, maybe that's something I need to do too. I don't know. Just seems like a waste, though. That room, uh, you know, if you throw anybody else in there, it's a waste of a waste of that room, in my opinion. So, it's like, it's unlimited X Men or nobody to me. Um, anyway, I think I like to use the special here. Get everybody going real quick. All right, let's put that uh, vulnerable on on Peggy here because I want Peggy to die. All right, I see some slightly more buffs on uh, on Agent Venom here, so I'm going to hit him. He's got three, not two. Get up just a little bit more damage. All right, now uh, he's probably going to resist this, but this is just to keep him from taunting. And I don't know if it... Yeah, he, oh, it got the ability block. Heck yes. All right, we're in business now. All right, so I need I need Peggy to die. And uh, I would like for him to die. That'd be nice. But Peggy has to die. Die, Peggy. Oh, Peggy lived. All right, I'm going to go here so I hit all three of them. Oh, Peggy's still alive. Not good. Peggy. Okay, good. There we go. There we go. And Cap is over here just like, oh, man, my whole team is dead. What do I do? I don't even know. Omega Red's like, I'll tell you what you need to do, Cap. You need to you need to just go away right now. You are in the wrong castle. <laughs> All right, so here I'm going to take uh, new warriors into Hero Asgardians. So I want to say I did this uh, did this battle yesterday. Actually, I wonder if I saved the team. I did not. <laughs> All right, so I guess I'll just build it one more time. Um, I think I had Kestrel on here, Cloak, Deadpool, Dagger, Kestrel. Actually, I kind of want to keep Kestrel in the other corner. And Cap Sam, yeah, because Cap Sam does the taunt. And he does the speed rewind. I still have an extra Dormammu here, too, I could throw in there, but I like having the double ping from, uh, from both Deathpool and Kestrel. And uh, as long as um, Valkyrie's passive doesn't proc, this this is an exceedingly easy match. So let's see if we get Valkyrie's passive to proc today. Hopefully, uh, fingers crossed, it don't happen. All right. Uh... She's a big girl. She can take it. Couple bleeds. Let's put the vulnerable on, on big boy there. All right. I'm basic into her. All right. If I can kill all these guys, that'd be excellent. Ooh, so close. Oh, there we go. All three of them gone. And then Death Bull's in there to just clean up. Bam. Super easy. There we go. Big old Lady Thor.
All right, so the last uh, last battle here, I'm just going to take Gamma. Oh, I guess I could take Dormammu if I wanted to. Nah, I like the full Gamma squad. It feels better this way. Plus, Dormammu in uh, this season of Crucible is really slow. You hardly even get to turn... Unless you take him for the Doom ride, then you get the turn. All right, so uh, I didn't see. Was this room? Oh, this is room three, not room four. <laughs> Why he didn't put these guys in room uh, four? They would have all gotten a re revive. Might have spawned with some immunity too, but but he didn't do it. <laughs> Maybe he just didn't read the rules. Maybe he just doesn't care. That, that's a possibility, too. I'm going to stun him. Keep him from doing his ultimate crap. Gives everybody all those buffs. All right. Um, so let's lay into him. Maybe it'll get... Yeah, there we go. So I was hoping kill, it would kill him, too. Turn rewind her. Don't want her to go get in the turn. All right. Let's, let's lay them all out right here. Boom. Boom. Get out of here, dudes. Oh, yes. Hulk smash. Goodbye, Bishop. See you next fall. So that was that was super efficient. Um, I hope I get like a. 815. Uh, see, that's the that's the best uh, five five person or five room run I've had all crucible so and I did what I could I did the best I could and hopefully he can't make it through my room five because I definitely can't make it through his room five I mean I got I got ribbons on on offense here I got Emma dorm surfer Carter that's about it oh and bionic Avengers still oh and I got Hella and and um Greg too I got the undying team so, you know, I might need to rethink some of my defense a little bit. We got a little bit too much on offense. Uh, I might pull, I don't know, Hella is so useful in like, I mean, Emma is so useful in so many different situations that it's hard to put her on defense. I might throw Dormammu on defense, though. He's not, he's not really doing much for me on offense. Well, that's not true. If I run into a Gamma... Or if I run into an unlimited, I use the gamma dorm combo combo on it, and it seems to work really well. So I don't know. I got what I got on on offense left over because he had a really really weak defense. I mean, he didn't have uh, any horseman teams on defense whatsoever. Zero horseman teams, all weaver defense basically. So, but anyway, all right. Till next time. See you guys.